guys how you doing it's a wonderful day outside and I thought I would do this product review for you and welcome to my channel welcome back to my channel obviously and if you're new welcome to my channel feel free to check out my blog after this review but today I'm going to be reviewing this soap right here this is the Burt's Bees baby bee buttermilk soap and by the way before I get into this to this review you might hear a bit of background noise but that's because I'm filming outside and unfortunately I don't have an external microphone so yeah like just now so I'm gonna try to be as loud as possible so you guys can actually hear me and there's a plane going above so I'll try to be as loud as possible here but I'm gonna be reviewing this soap this is the first Bees baby bee buttermilk soap and I found it at Publix for around four dollars and I think thirty to forty something cents I don't remember the exact price of it I know it can be found at Publix I don't know any other place where it can be found if you know of any other places where this particular soap can be found please tell me in the comments below I would greatly appreciate it but I decided to pick this soap up because I've been looking for more gentler soaps lately mostly unscented soaps with oatmeal in them and this isn't what the soap actually looks like, but as you can see, I've been using it a lot. It's supposed to be triple milled and it contains not only buttermilk powder, but it also contains ground oatmeal. So this soap was originally designed for babies, but adults can use it too. The fragrance itself pretty much smells like basically baby powder to me. If you smell typical baby, baby products, then you would understand, you'd be very familiar with the smell. It mostly smells just like baby powder to me so I'm fine with that it's okay the the size of the actual soap according to the box is supposed to be around it doesn't give in ounces and gives in grams and it's supposed to say 99.2 grams It's actually a very small circular soap like so small it can fit into the palm of my hand unfortunately this is all I can show you I don't have a new bar to show you but I absolutely love this soap. It's gentle on my skin and it's gentle on my face. And it's really good for shaving too. The lather that you get from this soap is bubbly yet foamy. In fact, because it's triple milled, it lasts a long time. I'm actually surprised I'm still having a little disc of this soap left. But it doesn't take up much work. It doesn't take a lot of work to actually work up a good lather for this soap. The only thing I would recommend is that if you're going to use this soap, I recommend that if you want the best benefits, shower or bathe in warm water. Or if you like using this soap on your kids, same thing, bathe in warm water, mostly lukewarm so you can protect the baby's delicate skin. But I don't have any kids so I can't really get into that. But anyway, I absolutely love this soap. It's very gentle on my face. It cleans my face very well but doesn't leave it very tight and dry feeling it just leaves my skin my facial skin very neutral on my body it gets rid of the dirt oil and sweat and it keeps me clean and on top of that it doesn't irritate my skin whatsoever it's probably because of the buttermilk powder and the oatmeal that's in it so big thumbs up for that and on top of that, if you have sensitive skin, if you're an older person and you have mature skin, this would be a great soap for you to try because it doesn't irritate your skin whatsoever. So I highly recommend it for older people that are dealing with aging and they just need an all gentle soap, soap that doesn't irritate their skin. But if you have dry skin, sensitive skin that easily breaks out, or if you have a combination of both, which is pretty much what I have when it comes to my body, since I have dry body skin, or like I said, if you're an older person, I would recommend that you try this soap out yourself. It is a wonderful soap to use, and I will definitely be using this soap again. Hmm. What else can I say? I already mentioned I like the scent. Now, I do have oily facial skin, and I find that this bar works pretty good, too. For shaving, it doesn't irritate your skin. Just make sure that when you shave with this soap, or when you shave with soap in general, make sure that you um, use like a pre-shave oil or any lightweight oil to um, add a thin layer of it onto the area that you want to shave before you lather up the area using this soap or any soap that you prefer. And even with lathering with this soap, it didn't even make me break out or leave me or raise a burn. So, 
definitely one of my favorite drugstore soaps and I will definitely try this again. Five out of five stars or five out of five flowers in my case. So I highly recommend this soap. And I'm going to see if I can use the rest of it um, the next time I hop in the shower because I still got a few more of it to use. It is triple milled so whether you're showering in hard water or soft water I'm pretty sure that if you dry out your bar carefully between uses this soap will last a very long time. If you tried this soap before or if you used it on your children before let me know how it worked for you in the comments below. I love reading the comments. If you can find this particular soap anywhere else at a different store let me know in the comments below because that would be extremely helpful. If you enjoyed this review a thumbs up is always appreciated and I will be releasing more reviews along with a future DIY recipe video that I'm still trying to plan out how I'm gonna film it. So thank you guys for watching and if you don't mind, after this video I'm just going to kick back and try to enjoy the nice weather since we already have a tropical storm next to us. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye everybody.